How y'all doing? What's happening? <clears throat> this video gonna be about baby formula, and now it's coming from overseas. Why all these checks cut to Ukraine, but they can't even have supplies? You know, we've been through this situation the last two and a half, almost three years, of a shortage of something. It's embarrassing. What country is so loose? in the pants that they don't take care of their own. What administration allows this to happen? There's also the elephant in the room is how and why would you almost want to have children during this particular last few years? Because it's not just the cost and the economics, but it's just the stupidity of not watching out for one another. I mean, there is some truth to that too, because you know, with everything that's still going on, it is like, well, I don't know if you really want to go through that situation in this country. They don't take care of their own. And baby formula, you know, they haven't taken care of the youth the last few years with the supplies and the demands and so on and so forth. And now with the, you know, with how they have been a lack of funding, which should still continue until you really see more green light, but still causes of deaths and so on and so forth. But just another shortage and just another behind the, the eight ball that America has been the last few years. And the leadership has been a tacky turkey move here. It's really been that bad. But uh, what do you think about the shortage of the baby formula? And what has it done for you personally? And how's it made you feel? Because I think that shortages are just inevitable. There's going to be something else that comes back again. You just know it. Please hit like, subscribe, welcome, thoughts, or comments. And I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind still. Watch out for another. And uh, just know the way they do it. All right, I'm out. Peace.